most difficult and hard to come by jobs on the island were handling loads. From handling ships international, all the way to getting them to faraway land. Oh, I like how we're giving uh, jurisdictions and any other orders. We have to keep up with the national shipping. And we may need a little bit of help from the other engines. I'm sure they'll need you. Aye aye. Captain Salty. Something like that. Most of the engines held an indignation briefing at Matford. Just wait till Sir Topham Hat finds out what is going to happen to Dono then. Are you joking with me? This had to be the second officious time we get to see Dono again. Only for a second time and a second life, my dears. Well, that's maybe. Just, uh. Can't get any less than that. Okay, uh. Let's all think that Sir Tom Hat's not here. So, uh. Anyone want to join me to see Dono again? Yes, sir. Right. Only a few engines are specifically allowed to do so. Thomas, Percy, Dennis, Penny, and Stephanie were on their way to the, to the docks. May, what's so important about the uh, docks thing? As we're quickly nowhere fast. Also, I teach you the canal shortcut as fast as uh, no one else will expect you to be. Right. Whatever the heck that is. Okay, guys, let's split up. Okay, me, Percy, Dennis, we go this way. You, Penny, and Stephanie, go that way. Right. I'm going this way, first you pick that way, and Dennis, you're going with me. Right, Thomas. Thomas and Dennis reach the canal. But we're wise not to go speeding through a canal. But how's a canal speed limit go? I guess I'll add on that. Back at Matford, the mainline engines were deciding what was next while Sir Topham Hat was absent. But Jesse arrived with an important letter. Oh, right. Here we go. And first of all, you run us, but what cost? Not only was that, but we didn't. We... Right, we'll just dismiss this stupid fact. But now, uh, yeah. Farewell. By that amount of time, the yard was in a dreadful muddle. Trucks everywhere. As Thomas hit the other fuel truck that had been derailed, it was now like a barrier holding them across. Okay, that's odd. So we're gonna have to get this straight. May what? I'll try to fetch the rescue trucks as uh, fast as I could. Bye, May what? They, they don't need any more trucks for now. But when Percy didn't notice, he ran to a line of trucks as the points were faulty. Oh, you there, Percy. You loading any trucks or something? Oh, what's going on? But Percy didn't respond to what Donna had said. Some of the trucks that went up ahead and knocking a faulty points. And there was a barrier between the two trucks. No, no! No, no! The yards are leading to the main line! Oh. Wait. We're a friend of what the heck is. Oh, no! It's Edward's line! Time must warn Edward!
Thomas was hard searching for the rescue truck. Well, he's there. All right, what's that, Thomas? We just started loading our trucks. You two. I need your two help. Sorry. We got to stick around and join with you two all day. I mean, we got a load to go through. Hey, never mind that. But do you know where the rescue trucks are? Afraid not, Thomas. I bet you'll have to go search another rail somewhere. Oh, right. Penny had just knew what to do with the other trucks. But what she didn't know is that she shunted him to the wrong line. Oh, man. That looks like... Oh, no. I know this line. It's... 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 Wait a minute. I got a whole line of, I got a whole line of trucks, so that means I'm safe. Penny can only hope her idea would work just before the express engine from, from track one had, had this part. Phew. That was lucky. But Penny was near a slope to where Percy had loaded several of the other trucks. The trucks didn't take much anymore. As at last, a coupling broke. Oh no. This thing shouldn't have happened earlier. I knew it. Percy didn't know what. He didn't look at the trucks behind him, but his driver could. Quick, Percy, move back fast! Percy reversed onto a siding. The trucks raced into another. Completely jumped off, jumped the barrier out. The barrier from the faulty points were cleared, but the following blockage had blocked some of the other rail. And it also blocked Percy, too. Oh, God! <gasps> oh, no! It's Maggie! Ya yeah, Warner! But indeed, Percy was right. Thomas was searching far and low from the island for the rescue truck. On the way, he found out that Spencer was nearby. Well, 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 if it isn't Thomas, he is a... Uh, what's that again? Well, Spencer, uh, there's been an accident at the dock. I mean... There's bits of barrier with the, uh, fuel trucks. And I have to, uh, fetch these rescue trucks fast. Hey, do you know anybody you can help? Yeah, I'm coming alongside. Stay out of my way, Thomas. But I wasn't in your way. I can assure you that, loser. <laughs> oh, shut up. See you when I can. <laughs> What's the big idea? However, in the end, Thomas fetched the rescue trucks and went on his way. Maggie came to the other side of the canal. But what she didn't know was that the trucks were in front of her. But she slid straight into them. Who put this here? So you didn't know, Maggie? You did not know these trucks were here the whole time. Oh, sorry. It was my fault for not knowing. 
Should be more careful next time. But she would have. All right, I got the fuel truck. <laughs> got the rescue trucks finally. About time. Thomas lifted several of the fuel trucks with the rescue truck. And Dennis had to help take them away. Yeah, I'm somewhat coming alongside. I better fetch them. Hey, Maggie, move out of the way, will ya? Oh, I should be more sensible than that. No, oh, about time you came with the rescue truck. Yeah, that's right, Percy. Now you better get these trucks out of the way, or else Salty will come back and see how much of a mess it is. Right. I'll get them. So it took several attempts from the rescue truck. Alright, anyone can proceed. Percy, move on first. Okay, Thomas. Right. Maggie, you're next. I'll try to remember to be more sensible the next time. Alright, easy going now. Easy going. But later that evening, Salty came back to see it the yard was repaired once again. Hello, Salty. We just repaired the, uh, the yard. Now it looks completely new again. Well, that wasn't very much compared to what could have happened. Well done, me hotties. <laughs> oh, you said that was a very hard, didn't you, Thomas? Well said, Dennis. <laughs> The engines told Salty all about what had happened throughout the yard. And we would have a great respect of trucks too. Because if you barely had any recognition with any trucks. But to what the pleasing would have said.